me Anthony O'Day. Welcome back to another video. I'm here in my garage right now and uh, don't mind the hair. It's kind of going insane. I need a haircut, but that's not important because today we're going to be changing it up a little bit. Instead of riding, I decided I'm going to show you guys my scooter wheel collection. All the scooter wheels I have. I guess I'll go over how I got them, how long I rode them for, and I'll tell you guys how good they were and just my experience with all the wheels. So let's begin. So we're gonna start right here with the wheels I have on right now, which are the Clayton Lindley Signature Wheels by Rue Industries. So I've had these wheels for like a year now, but I haven't rode them until like really recently, since like two weeks ago maybe, because I was saving them for a trip to Woodward and then I could never go. So far the wheels are really good and they're fast and I, I can't really talk about how good they are because I haven't had them on for too long, but so far, they're pretty good and I like the colors too, they're really cool. Okay, so now I'm gonna go over the wheels that I have that aren't on my scooter. And for some of the wheels I have like, the, I have both wheels, but for others I only have one. It's because some of the wheels are on these decks right here. But regardless, I'm still gonna show you guys these wheels. So here it is, all the wheels I have pretty much. That's quite a collection. I'm gonna start with my newest pair and then go down to the oldest pair. So right here, I got Rapture Pro Screw Wheels, New Look Wheels. I did a whole video reviewing these. They'll be up in the cards right there. Pretty good wheels. I've only rode them once, so they're a little marked up, but that's it. Again, haven't used these wheels for that long, but these are pretty good. They're pretty fast, and yeah, hopefully I'll get some use out of them soon. Pretty good wheels, though. Okay, so this is the next wheel. This is Liberty Pro Screw Wheel. I got these in like March or April, and I only rode them for a few months. This started happening, so I couldn't ride them anymore. I still have the other wheel, other wheel and one of those decks over there. Yeah, this one's totally shot. It took me a few months, like I said, but in that time, it was a pretty good wheel. But yeah, too bad I couldn't get more uh, riding out of it. All right, next up, we got these proto wheels. Here's one of them, pretty, not bad, you know? These wheels were 80 bucks, but this is one of the wheels, and this is the other wheel. And like I said, the price, 80 bucks, pretty expensive for wheels, so you think they'd be good. This happened in two weeks of me having the wheel, so safe to say I got ripped off, kind of sucks. I wouldn't recommend these wheels, sorry Proto, but come on, two weeks, like, are you kidding me? All right, next up, we got these two wheels, Root Industry Type R wheels, but these wheels, they were pretty good, but they kind of suck. This one in the front is obviously the hub, as you can tell. And this one in the back, the bearing always like pops out or something. That's why it's taped up. Again, pretty good wheels while they lasted. They just didn't last long enough. All right, what's next? Oh, these wheels. Okay, so these are Lucky, what are these? Uh, Lucky Coaster wheels. I actually got these in a giveaway from Lucky. I don't know if they still do them, but they did these Freebie Friday giveaways on Instagram and I won them and I won these wheels in that. Luckily, they're free, as you can tell, dehubbed, the front one, and this other one's on its way to being dehubbed. These were pretty good wheels. They last me a while, and I did get them for free, so that's a bonus. The next wheels we got are these John Marco V2 SIG wheels. These wheels lasted me a while, and as you can tell, I shredded them up like crazy. These are probably the best or one of the best wheels I've had though. They've lasted me, they lasted me like six months, which is a while for me. I, I go through wheels pretty easily, as you can tell. But um, these lasted me six months and even though I sh absolutely shredded them up, they never dehubbed yet at least. So not bad wheels, I would recommend these. So next up we got this Root Industry Honeycomb wheel in blue. These get a bad rap because of all the holes and they're like really like easy to break. But this is still in good condition. I still put it on every now and then when I need a wheel. And yeah, I've had these for like, a while. I don't even know how long, but a while. And they're pretty good. Not bad, actually, for me at least. Like I said, these get a bad rap for breaking, but I guess I'm just lucky or something because these haven't broken or dehubbed or anything. And yeah, they're just worn out because they're old, but they're still good wheels. All right, next up, we got these Ethic wheels right here in red. These came with the Ethic Artifact V2 Complete. Pretty worn out wheels, obviously, but just like with the John Marco wheels, these were pretty good and they have lasted me a while and I still put them on every now and then, just like with the Honeycomb wheel. 
The complete I got with this was pretty good. I, I used it for a while. The deck did snap though, but these wheels were probably the best thing from it. Overall, not bad wheels. I would recommend these. Okay, so we have two wheels left to review, but if you guys are enjoying this video, go down, drop a like and subscribe to my channel and let's see these two wheels. So this wheel, I think it's called like a Kutrick wheel. It's some, uh, it was like some all, like low key scooter brand and I got these wheels relatively cheap, but these weren't bad. ABEC 11 bearings, so pretty good bearings in these. And yeah, pretty good wheels lasted me a while. I had these when I first started scootering and yeah, pretty good wheels. And finally, the last wheel I have here, boom, this, this green thing. This is a fusion wheel. Um, don't know what name, I'm just gonna say it's a Fusion 110 mil wheel. It's probably 100 mil now, because of how worn out it is. This wheel lasted me basically a year, and they were pretty good. You know, they, they got the job done, and they're messed up now, but they're pretty cool. This was also back when Fusion products sucked, and now Fusion like, has really good products, but back, back then, Fusion products weren't really the best, but these were pretty good. So there it is, that is the collection of scooter wheels that I have, that is, all those wheels have lasted me like four, almost five years. Um, so as you can tell, I go through wheels like that. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like, subscribe, click on the bell icon for post notifications every single time I upload a video, which is every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 3.30 p.m. Eastern time. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.